harassing the people. Badge number, first badge number, gang unit, badge number, no warrants. Since last night, you've been harassing these brothers. Can I get your badge number? I don't want to get too close to your investigation because I got the call like you. It wasn't a crowd. You know what the day is. So this is actually harassment. How you doing, sir? Can I get a uh, badge number, special gang unit here? You're in team traffic. Video I can't shoot. get through. Can't Everybody, yeah, look at your car. No, I can't get through. This is a public... I mean, I'm not asking you. You're doing an investigation. I don't want to impede on your, on your investigation, right? Yeah, I got an old lady that's waiting to get through, and we can't get through, sir. I'm just saying. Right? Hello? And they have a and does he have a they warrant have a to just be walking up the cars? Who were you at? Do you have a warrant? You can do that? You can't do that. You can't walk and look in cars. That, you didn't get a car here, sir. That, that's, that, come on now, for real. Have them train you right. Have your senior train you right. You cannot do that. You can't. You have to have a reason, a reasonable suspicion. Then you gotta tell a person under the new law why you pulled them out. Are we aware of that? Are you aware of reparations law? SD 1331. This is actually a threat on the Chaco slaves at this point. I am auditing for SD 1331. Okay, that's harassment of African Americans of chattel slavery, reparations law. So you got to hit federal, you keep it up. Keep it up. Black people are banding together. Russia is in Cuba right now. Y'all little game is over with, buddy. And you got all the Muslims mad because y'all blowing up kids in Palestine. And you want to keep treating black African Americans like this. Huh? You want to keep treating American, black African Americans like slaves. That's what the fuck y'all keep doing. Y'all keep pushing y'all issue on black African Americans. But you ain't doing this to nobody else. Just us, huh? This shit gonna stop. It's gonna stop. Russia is in Cuba, motherfucker. The lights gonna go out. What you gonna do then when the lights go out? And them savages come out the hunt. Y'all gonna go in the house? You guys are impeding traffic. Okay, you cannot do this. This is illegal search and seizure. Let me get some names here. You can't walk up to somebody, get you acting on them. That's illegal. These are American citizens. These are not illegal immigrants. No disrespect to our brown brothers, too. You can't walk over and get to touch it on them. That's illegal. I'm taping it. Don't touch them. Don't search no cars. You can only look and observe. Walk your ass up out of here. And I need that car moved, by Come the way. here to this wall today to wish everybody a happy hood day. Um, not just this hood day, but everybody's hood day came together in, here on Slauson and Crenshaw, along with the tribe, the last tribe, the final tribe, to tell the message from the messenger himself, Elijah Muhammad, Louis Farrakhan, that's the far Muhammad. As Farrakhan came on this very soil, March 31st. <clears throat> and I myself had the privilege of witnessing the beginning and the end of this prophecy prevailing here, Nipsey Hussle. Thank you, brother. We now and finally see what you envision uh, from the F Donald Trump song to putting your very life on the line for us. You and YG, thank y'all. As of right now, we do have boats uh, right outside Cuba finishing up the prophecy you foreseen as well as a conviction of a president that you convicted way before his conviction. And we understand now, Nipsey, YG. Um, a lot of people are going to be celebrating a lot of people are going to be witnessing the end of our very society um, so I myself have a, a job to do to lead them accordingly and take over from here 
And I hope that I'm able to envision what you envision, Nipsey. And, uh, you know, YG, thank y'all. Um, it's always been fuck Donald Trump. Fuck anybody who oppressed us, who kept us in this bondage for 400 years. Fuck y'all. Fuck your mama. Fuck all your kids. But I know why you did it. You know, I know why I was cursed for my albino kids and lied to. You call them albinos. I call them my sons and daughters who obviously bred it and made the white race and the black mothers who hid them in the caves from me and my ignorance and thinking that they were a disease and a curse. And we come to our final battle and final end of white cleansing white in the last days. Nuclear weapons are right there on the coast. They don't have to get a nuclear weapon. They can do an EMP, electromagnetic post. Knock out the power and we'll purge ourselves like they're doing there in Watts, Compton, South L.A., shootings after shootings. We don't know what the hell is going to happen next. Kids, women, shot, riding down the street in the court. And the constant harassment of these Trump coppers every single day in this area should make us very angry. Almost like the 92 riots. So if y'all gonna make it through this, we gotta band together. We gotta tear this motherfucker up. And you better be with the last tribe and you better free Palestine. You better. That's what you better do. You better get with the Muslim Ummah. Because anybody that ever told you the truth and fought for y'all was Islam. You know, no disrespect to Jews, but obviously that religion ain't for us. You know, they killing kids and babies and shit. Although, Hamas, you know, you kind of got it in too now. But Ishmael and Isaac are the children of Adam and Eve. And um, we all birthed, meaning the black man birthed a white child out of our own womb. You know, from my nuts into her womb came an albino, as you would call him, but I called him my son and daughter, who birthed all the nations of light. So from darkness into light, let us go. Let it be. We'll go back into darkness, into light, again and again. But I say to you, happy, sadly, very seriously, hood day. And thank y'all for bringing us into the future as we know it. Finished prophecy, that's what's up. It's your boy Mason I 3 3 I will be in the area as best I can. Obviously, a lot of shootings are plaguing our community as the token of reparations is nearing. Um, I do want to say to everybody who, you know, witnessed what happened here, thank God to Inc. One. Thank you, Inquan, for painting a three-dimensional vision of yourself through the eyes and through the spiritual body of Nipsey Hussle. Uh, many times here, I can remember having to come out here and redo this mural, redo the other murals, uh, along with Inquan, stand on post. Why this brother gets out here and make sure the image of our Messiah of our times don't go without notice if you know what I mean so it's important to keep the images of now we never seen this coming no one has ever seen this coming and uh, as we go into our own graves and our own lives I do want to say you are watching a million hits for the gone and never ever forgotten as we get ready for World War 3 countdown is now in effect and the marathon will always continue. Peace. Hold in Harling, gmail.com one. The best gumbo through LA. You will love it. If you want something hot, something fresh, something real nifty to fill your tummy, in places and different events, you can take some nifty gumbo five. You love fives on hook. Yo, Mac in with Holden Harlan, gmail.com one.
That's my homeboy, King Five Fingers Uncle. And he has the best gumbo around L.A. I'm going to keep it 55th Street.